Republican superpowers are in Minneapolis tonight, raising money for what's expected to be one of the closest watched elections in the country this year. Michelle doesn't just tell them no, she tells them H-E-L-L -L no. Former Alaska Governor Sarah Palin headlined the re-election rally for Representative Michelle Bachman. Thousands attended the event in downtown Minneapolis this afternoon. Pat Kessler explains why it was more than just a rally, it became a celebration. With two of the most powerful conservative voices in the country on stage, Bachman and Palin made it more than just a rally. It was a celebration of all things conservative. Minnesota, you are awesome. Minnesota, you just rock. And we thank you for sending Michelle Bachman back to the United States House of Representatives. Facing a tough re-election fight, Bachman talked not about the six districts she represents, but about freedom and liberty, terrorism, President Obama, and Speaker Pelosi, and a promise to lead the charge to repeal health care. I think I heard someone say repeal. You better believe it, baby. Repeal is what this girl is going to be all about after November. The star-studded event included the television host Sean Hannity, who broadcast from the rally. A jubilant crowd of 11,000 got free tickets, in return for promising to work on Republican campaigns, many said they were energized by Bachman's message. Obama lied to us. He said he was centrist. He is to the left. And he's ruining this country. And I am angry and I'm self-employed and I do not like what's happening to this country. Bachman is campaigning for re-election in Minnesota's 6th Congressional District. She'll be up against Democratic State Senator Terrell Clark and Maureen Reed, who was once an independence candidate for lieutenant governor. Democrats and labor unions rallied at the Capitol against Palin and Bachman. Democratic Congressman Keith Ellison called the Bachman rally a vision of fear. I don't hate her and neither should you. The fact is, I feel sorry for her because she doesn't know how it feels to be unified with the people, doing something good where everybody can prosper and everybody can do well and everybody can have what they need. After the rally at the Capitol, DFL protesters stood outside the Hilton Hotel. That's where Bachman and Palin appear tonight. The protesters passed out flyers supporting the president's health care reform, a program both Bachman and Palin disagree with.